This is Mitty Rods of Steve. Together here with your Sunday night forecast. Well, we tracked a weather system through the area this morning, and now we're tracking lake effect snow still to come through Monday night. We could see up to two inches in the shade of white, one to three inches in this area of blue. The darker blue, we could see two to four inches of snow. Then for Kosciuszko County, we'll see three to six inches of snow with the heftiest totals being off to our northwest downwind of Lake Michigan. Now remember, this is lake effect snow, so there will be very variations in these snowfall totals. This is our best estimate based on where we think the lake effect snow bands will set up. Just remember down the street there could be much less snow compared to what you're seeing in your backyard. We'll be tracking this closely for you. Here on Futurecast, tracking the lake effect snow this evening, it becomes more widespread into the overnight hours and we see some pockets of heavy snow at times and travel impacts become more of a concern as temperatures dip below freezing. Look at this. We'll be in the 20s as you head out the door early Monday morning. Factor in the window, it's going to feel like it's in the teens. So make sure you bundle up as you go back to work or school. Now we'll see a bit of a lull in the precipitation during the morning, even tapping into some sunshine through around lunchtime. But as we get to late in the afternoon, the lake effect snow returns. High temperatures only reaching up to around the freezing mark in the Summit City. And we'll see wind gusts at times up to 30 miles per hour. Now the lake effect effect snow really comes back then into Monday evening into Monday night. You see there could be some really heavy snow bands here occurring. So we'll keep a close eye on this for you before we finally see an end to the lake effect snow Monday night. But temperatures dropping down into the 20s. So still travel concerns out there for your Tuesday morning commute. As you look at the exclusive 10 day forecast, only the slight chance for rain or snow shower on Tuesday. It'll be a cloudy and windy day, a high of 37 degrees. We'll be back to the 40s on Wednesday, but still windy. It's not until we get to Thursday those winds calm down and we climb back up into the 50s. So the taste of winter relatively short lived here, even getting back up to 60 by the time we get to Saturday. But we're tracking some rain to pass through on Sunday and that'll cool us down toward the end of the 10 day forecast with high temperatures dipping back into the upper 40s.